Welcome to County Office, your ultimate guide to local government services and public records. Let's get started. Can I get food stamps while in jail? So you're wondering if you can get food stamps while you're in jail. Let's break it down. First, when you're incarcerated, your eligibility for food stamps, also known as SNAP, Supplemental Nutrition Assistance Program, changes. According to the Food and Nutrition Act, if you're incarcerated for more than 30 days, you're not eligible for SNAP benefits. Here's how it works. When you're in jail, your benefits will be suspended or terminated. This is because the law requires state agencies to match all adult household members against the Social Security Administration's records to ensure that people who are incarcerated are not receiving benefits. If you're in jail for less than 30 days, your benefits might not be affected, but once you hit that 30-day mark, your benefits will be stopped. This is to maintain program integrity and prevent improper payments. Three. When you're released from jail, you can reactivate your benefits. You'll need to contact the relevant social services office and provide the necessary documentation to show that you're no longer incarcerated. It's also important to note that some states have additional rules related to drug convictions that can affect your eligibility for SNAP and other benefits even after you're released. For example, some states still have lifetime bans on SNAP and TANF for people with certain drug convictions, although many states have lifted these bans in recent years. So, to sum it up, you cannot receive food stamps while you're in jail for more than 30 days but you can get them back once you're released and you meet the necessary eligibility criteria. To learn more, check out these links, which you can click in the description below. And feel free to comment your questions. We're here to help. Thanks for tuning in to our video. Please like and subscribe and leave a comment below. See you in the next video.